hello, this is Eden Hammer. Welcome back to Bless Online. So, when last we left, we were in the Dust Bowl. And we were level 38, needed to be level 39 for our story quest. To go to the temple here. The Occupied Temple. So, I did, as you can see... Oh, I missed two. I thought I did all of them but one, but I missed two. So, I did a little story quest. Oh, shut up, you succubus. Nasty. Dirty girl. So, I did all the quests and I made a little montage. So, I'll play that real quick for you here. I decided to do a little montage of completing quests. So, here we go. I did all the side quests in the Dust Bowl, except for one, which I forgot about. So you'll see me kill the mad scientist here with a bunch, bunch of frame drops. And tonight I had a lot of trouble with lag and frame drops. So, but I did kill him. As you can see, he kind of knocked me down a little bit. I stopped after a few minutes of this, but uh, a couple of these were fun, kind of fun, so I went ahead and put them in. Uh, we're just doing doing quests in the Dust Bowl, trying to get to level 39 so we can continue our story quest. And three quarters of the way here. I did a couple monster books too. That's the chieftain one. Get to watch them talk to each other. I hate you. I've been waiting for this for a long time. Kill you now. Kill his dad or something. So there's a new chieftain over there. Just a bunch of completions on the, the side. I thought I would throw them in just for fun of it, but you don't have to watch me actually do them, which is probably a lot more fun. Okay, now that you're totally bored to death, let's continue on with our story quest. So, we have to head to. Aviv's monster meat and apply medicine power powder which is right up here and then we have to go to the temple of the night the occupied temple of the night hmm so let's get our mounts up let's see what mount needs uh, let's go ahead and level our horse so level our horse up a little bit let's get a little path going here And we're off. Do we go up and do the... No, oh, I'll come back and do that one. Let's go to the temple. We want to do story quests. You guys don't want to see me do side quests, do you? No, that's lame. You idiot. That's what you should say to me. Yeah, there's a bunch of... We'll come back and do monster books over there and stuff. So I don't think I've ever said the origin of the name The Idiot Hammer. Uh, I had another YouTube channel that for some reason uh, YouTube says that I violated the terms of service and they removed my channel. I didn't have anything really posted on it. I didn't use it for like two years so I don't know what I did. But they said I was a bad boy and they deleted that channel. And I got a couple other channels too for personal use and family stuff. Um, but, so, I lost that channel. That was a, that was a cool name channel. 
and I was like, eh, I'm gonna play some games and I'm gonna record them and I'll put them up to see if anybody enjoys them, you know. I know how boring it is to watch me, but, you know, I thought it'd be fun, and it has been so far. So I was sitting there and I was thinking, oh, leave me alone. What can I name my channel? You know, and all the good names are taken, you know how that is. Uh, my other channel had a really good name, but can't use that anymore because it's banned or whatever. Even though it only had like two videos on it and I didn't post for two years. That's probably what I did. I removed it because I didn't post forever. Anyway, continuing on. So, come on up with a name. Go inside. There's bad guys here. Anyway, I was c trying to come up with a name and uh, for years and years and years I kept saying that I wanted to have a hammer for all the idiots in the world, you know, especially driving. There's lots of idiots driving. So I figured, hmm, I will make a hammer, like a, you know, uh, a cushioned hammer. That I don't want to hurt anybody, but I want a big eye on it. So you whack people in the head and you leave a big eye red mark on their head or a bruise. And I called it the idiot hammer. I wanted a hammer and you thunk the idiots on the head, knock some sense into them. And then leave a little eye on there for idiot. Yeah, I'm weird. Yeah, I'm weird. But anyway, that's what I was was doing. That's what I kept talking about for years. And that's where I came up with the name Idiot Hammer. And I figured, oh, I'll see if it works. And it did. So here we are. Let's see what goes on here. Give up now. Don't attack the half naked ladies. You anymore. How foolish. Kill them all. I guess I should help, huh? Let's get all the money before they... Who's attacking me? You are my next target. Oh, dang. We're almost dead. I probably just have to defeat the one guy, right? Let's get some health back real quick. Don't die, naked ladies. Don't die. I'll be right there. Okay, here we go. Ready? Speak to the high priest. I was able to defeat the minions of Judith thanks to you. So now it's my turn. I shall recover the stone of sealing you have with you. You knew I was coming. Oh. I knew the destiny of the Anatavaran would lead here. Enough of that. We need something else before we can restore the stone of sealing. We priests will prepare the ritual here. But I will need your help. I bet you that's why they're half naked, because they knew I was coming, right? You think? No? Okay. How can I operate the obelisk, even though you haven't told me about the obelisk yet? Activate the three obelisks located at the entrance and the top of the temple. The minions of Judith should have the spell to activate them. So defeat them, activate the obelisks, and return to us. All right. They should have used that actor for more voiceovers, because she has a good voice. I like it. <laughs> oh, 
Alright, you guys are all dead. We need to find the obelisks. The assassin doesn't do as well as my other characters when I go into groups like that. Got to uh, adjust my playstyle a little bit, I think, because it's really not working out so great. I almost died. Uh-oh. Who attacked me? No! Don't attack me! Come over here! I did figure out something I didn't know. Let's open this up. In our... What is it? Uh, no, 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 no. Hold on. I'm thinking. Thinking and it's not working. My brain's not working. Uh, three, two, two. This one. The Shadow Vortex. I did not know that sucked all the mobs into you. Um... Yep. Enemies located in the Shadow Vortex will be pulled towards the middle and afflicted with a dot. What you get for not reading stuff, huh? Got the spell note. So what do I do now? Oh, still have to kill this guy. All right, let's cast the spell. <laughs> I'm such a dork. I need another spell for this one. I killed the officer. Alright. Cast this one. Boobity bloobity abracadabra. All that stuff. Boobity boobity. Yeah. Go up here to the top. How do we get to the top of the thing, my jigger? Bunch of those glowing things have something to do with it. Move the crystal. Oh, there we are on the top. What do we do now? Oh, we have to activate it. We're down. All right, where's that half-naked lady? Let's find her again. Elves are cooler looking than the other ones. Here, take the recovered stone of ceiling. But it is not enough to stop the Black Tower. Oh, I figures you'd say that. What do I do then? All we can do is complete the vessel. You need to find the power for it from somewhere else. Find the elves that yield life magic and look for their wisdom. Are you talking about the elves? There are sylvan elves guarding the Tree of Life in the Northern Continent. They would gladly help you. This is all we can offer. Aren't you an elf? You've entered a disputed zone. Alright. Wait, that's, that's super way north, man. Oh, should we take the quests? I hate to leave the half-naked ladies without helping. Whoa, what are you doing here, dude? I thought it was all half-naked ladies. Rita. I like how they cover their face, but they're they're basically hanging all out. 
but they'll cover their face to preserve modesty, uh, I assume. Or maybe they all have colds. It's a sanitary thing. You don't want me to catch the flu, do you? Thank you very much. All right, we're gonna leave the side quests for now. We might have to come back later and do them, but I don't want to right now. Can I use that? Or is that a bad city? There's a bad city here, I think. Well, not a bad city, but a, a union city. But I do want to use that Migdal. Is this Migdal city? We will run back. Oh, wait a second. I can recall. Open up. There we go. We'll do this. I can make a magic too. All right. So we are back in here, and there's a wavern right over here. Oh, we gotta go clear. See, this is what I expect a priest to wear. Something like this. Well, although she doesn't have any pants on, as you can see, but, you know, the whole robe thing. What's with all the people not wearing clothes, man? It doesn't look that hot out here. You can wear pants. Where can I go? So, here we go. We're down here. Uh, we have to go clear up to here. It's going to cost me a full gold to go up there. That's... That's mean. I don't have that much. Almost 50 gold. All right. I will do it. All right. So we're going to fly. Way up there. And I'm going to pause the recording. Because it will take 15 minutes to get up there. Stupid wyverns. Why so slow? And they're like, oh, look, there's my friend wyvern. I need to stop for a second. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. I'll see you later. Like, everyone they see, they're like, have to say hi. Okay, we'll be back. And we're back! I bet you that's the fastest trip you ever watched. Okay, so we gotta find Dydan. Alright, let's fix our spawn point here. And it's, oh, of course, it's on the other side. Here we go. Hi, Dan. I remember you. My elf helped you a lot. I was expecting a visitor, and it was you. I'm Tanara, the great protector of the Sylvan Elves. Lately, I have become a representative of the Sylvan Elves again. Yes, I helped you with my elf character to do that. I'm awesome. The Dayton tribesmen said you tried to revive the Stone of Sealing, but you need the magic of the elves for that. So I expected you would come here. But I'm sorry. The Sylvan Elves cannot help you. What the hell? You know how far I flew? And it cost me a whole gold. The only person who can revive the Stone of Sealing is the Queen of the Elves. But the Queen has been dead for a thousand years. It is impossible to revive the Stone of Sealing. I heard someone's prediction that she was coming back to life. Did the Grand Seer of the Fidean really say that the Stone of Sealing can be revived? Deblahim cannot be lying. I must ask Handor whether she knows something about it. Yeah, I just want to point out really cool. Deblahim is a cool name. Look how it's spelled. Deblahim. I, I, I like that name. It's really cool. Candor. That is the name of a unicorn who is closer to the queen than anybody. So if you find Candor. You may find a way to revive the Stone of Sealing. Kando resides at the Water Mist Nest. Go and meet her there. All right. Kandor might know how to restore the Stone of Sealing. Go and find Kandor at the Water Mist Nest. Didn't you just say that? Why are you repeating it? Elves are weird. Okay, so how do we get over to Kandor's Nest? 
take that path so we'll go over here oh wait I'm in a town hey guys I'm in a town I can do stuff I haven't been able to do for a while we need tools no we have enough tools hmm but we have uh I need yeah here we go okay I'm gonna do a little bit of crafting here but I think I have a lot of iron and stuff so We have a lot of iron. We do have a little bit of iron. <sighs> well, we have stone. We'll add to our stone. Don't need silver. Okay, so I'm gonna do a little crafting and I will be back. All right, now that we're done with that. I got my skill up quite a bit. I am now a skilled alchemist and an expert crafter. And I got a couple bowls worth of experience off of it too. That's good. Alright, so we need to go speak to Daiden at the water mist nest. Get a pet out here. Or not a pet, a mount. Let's go find a unicorn. How many high level scrolls? I could tame me a couple unicorns. I died in right there, but that's the wrong one. Everything's died down. I think we have a bug, folks. Everything is labeled as died in. I wonder if I'm labeled as died in. Oh, oh, we're running away. Uh oh, died in's attacking us. Look out, there's another died in in front of us. He's laying down, he's sick. Dan. What's going on? Hey, here's your friend Dan. <laughs> oh, just when you think they can't get any more bugs. Every mob in the game is named Dan. Uh oh, there's an evil horse Dan. Another Daidan. I bet there's some more Daidans up there. No, don't hurt me, Daidans. Can I get up here and skip this? Ooh, I can. Oh, Daidans up there. Gotta be careful. Well, the quest says speak to Daidan, so. It should be fairly easy to complete. <laughs> oh, can't remember this guy's name. Right. There's Daidan. It has been a long time since we've seen a stranger. I've been waiting for you a long time, Anasavarin. I am Kandor. You wish to meet me? You are Daidan. The Daidan tribe told me about you. They said that you need the Queen's magic to revive the Stone of Sealing. And that means... It must mean that Her Majesty will be resurrected. How does that work? 
You cannot be here without the resurrected queen. Without her, your fate is not complete. This is why I've waited, Anatavarin. I don't believe it. Um, I think we speak to this, Dayton. The spinning wheel of memory is to the southwest of Watermist Nest. This is the wheel which holds the memories of the ritual day a thousand years ago. Go there, and you will learn about the resurrection of the Queen. All right. I will go to the spinning wheel of memory and wait there. If you go there, you will learn the truth of the ritual day. And you will also know how to revive the Stone of Sealing. All right. If you're curious about the truth, come to the spinning wheel of memory. You guys are always repeating yourself. The dead ends my are. longing for you pierces my heart. You are my Ooh, light, man. but you are lost to me. Oh, talking unicorn. Or, I'm sorry, talking Daidan. <laughs> I still think that's, that's the dumbest bug that I have seen yet. Let's get a horse. Or, let's get a Daidan. So that elf we talked to at the beginning, her name isn't Daidan either. So it must have been a bug when we zoned into this stupid zone. Because those are like outlaw hunters or something like that. Of course, the unicorns are unicorns. Poachers, I think is what these guys are. Die dance. Oop, we missed it. But we need to find the wheel of memory. I've been waiting for you. It's me, Candor the Unicorn. I've just changed my appearance temporarily. I see that. This thing next to me is the spinning wheel of memory. Where's the echo? Spin it, and you can see the ritual day. To resurrect the queen, the elves used forbidden magic. What do you mean forbidden magic? And why did the echo go away? That's freaking me out. When the queen of the elves died, the queen's protectors could not accept her death. So to revive the queen, the elves used forbidden magic. And what happened after that? The rest you should see for yourself. Spin the wheel next to you. Then you will be back at the ritual day a thousand years ago. Right. The wheel is intertwined with my memories. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you wish to learn the truth of that day, spin the wheel. This is the Hyrn Protected Zone. Oh, oh die Dan still. Damn it. I hope you won't start believing that the memory is reality. I'll bring you back before it's too late. Tell me when you're ready. What should we do? Now you will see the ritual day. The memory that I stole and entrapped. Find some clues about the resurrection of the queen here. What should I look for? The people who performed the ritual that day were the four protectors. The leader was Darian. I'll make you appear as if you're a supporter of Darian. Are you sure it's not died in? Follow Darian's commands. Then you will naturally learn what happened that day. Alright. Find Darian so you may know what happened. Since he was the one who led all that took place. Dwarves! Where are the dwarves in this game? Please select a valid target. They were here. Well, 
That's kind of cool too. I wish I knew what the hell it was. Come on, dwarves. I'd be a dwarf. Dwarves are cool. Game's kind of incomplete without dwarves. I went the wrong way. More dead ends. And I watch out for this dead end. Oh, oh, we got an itch in my nose. So we need to find Gaidan. <laughs> oh, super annoying. Everything's Daidan. Oh, we can sell stuff to Daidan. <sighs> How about Darian the here? Ceremony is taking too long. I'm sorry, Daidan. I just got here. Did Kandor send you? I was worried. I'm relieved to see that you made it here safely. I'm afraid that Tanara might have sensed what is going on somehow. Tanara we might is have the to finish the ceremony okay. even earlier than planned. Is it going okay? Most of the preparation for the soul of the queen is complete. But the most vital ingredient, the blood of the dragon, is not yet here. It must be because of Tanara's meddling. I need you to go there and secure it. All right. Go straight up from here along the northern path. Search for Rastia. She is supposed to be carrying the blood of the dragon. And if you find Rastia, return here with her. All right. Rastia, who was charged with the task of bringing the dragon's blood, still isn't here. I don't have a good feeling about this. All right, so we a couple quests here. A dwarf! Dude, he is badass looking. Look at that dwarf. I want to play a dwarf. Dude, look how badass that guy is. That's totally cool. I feel like it got gypped. Alright, so we got all these extra quests we're going to try to complete while we're in here. Protected Flower. Dude, there's a battle going on. Why are you back here? Taking a pee? Hurry up. Need three more flowers. Flower, wait. 
Scales. Three more flowers. that guy. those old artifacts whatever they do you have to sprinkle holy water on the ground five times so there's one Yeah, there's more Didans out here. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just can't get over it. We only need two more of these. I'll just do that and get the partial book anyway. the resurrection of the queen what a relief that i met you before it was too late i have bad news i've been robbed and lost the blood of the evil dragon can you be more Nara specific has already learned of what we're planning to do the successor of lilianthes intervened to stop the ritual before they arrive we need to successfully complete the ritual what should we do? The successor of Lilianthes took the blood of the evil dragon. Drive them away. The ritual must take place. 
If we retrieve the blood of the evil dragon and take it to Darien, our work will be complete. Okay, rest easy. Die peacefully. Please recover the dragon's blood right, so and we take it do. to Darien. Oh wait, these are the guys that got killed. Yeah, hotty elves. Valid target. That was easy. So we run back. I'd like to kill a few more elves just because they make me mad sometimes. But I'll be a good boy. So the ritual is not over when I get there. It's shooting me. Sorry, can't stop. I'm busy. Alright, let's make sure we talk to all these extra dudes. This guy. And now we talk to Darian. I assume Rastia didn't make it. It seems the successors of Lilianthes already made their move. We don't have much time. We must finish the ceremony quickly. What should we do? Pour the blood of the dragon on the serma that lies on the body of the queen. Then we, the four guardians, will perform the ceremony. All right. Spray the dragon's blood onto the serma. Let us start the ritual for our queen. Cutscene. Oh, I want a dwarf. They're so cool. Or some pants. Hurry and get out of here. You must resurrect the queen at any cost. Uh, you're leaving her body behind. What are you doing? This is the Hyrn Protected Zone. Tanara caught us red handed after all. But the ceremony was a success. Now. It's all up to Archiel. It will take a long time, but the Queen will live again. I see. You need to get away from here too, before it's too late. The punishment that awaits the four of us will be enough. All right. The punishment for us four protectors should be enough. Leave this place before it is too late. Oh, that chick has cool armor. I want it. Yeah, we'll get rid of that too. Alright. Equipment merchant. Yeah, I don't need to worry about that right now. I'm looking for you though. There you are. So let's go talk to Kandor. The protectors did. This goes against Providence. You two must pay for this. Um, see you later. Sorry. <laughs> Not sticking around. Oh wait, two. I need to lay the wreath down somewhere. On her body, that's right. 
So. Sorry, Queen. I will see you later. Alright, now we go talk to Kandor. I hope you won't start believing that the memory is reality. I'll bring you hurry. You've spent too much I hope you won't start believing that I'm ready. Get me out of here. I'm glad you escaped safely. Now it is time for me to thank you. Thank you for letting me know what happened on that day. What are you talking about? You're the one that stole the memory. The ceremony of Darien and the Protectors succeeded. Archiel escaped here with a sealed memory of the Queen. A thousand years have passed. Archiel must have resurrected the Queen. Mm, I, see. I kept it secret for a long time. But now, the time it tell Tanara the truth. That the ritual on that day succeeded, and the queen go All to right. Elgratis and tell Tanara that her majesty has returned. All right, folks, I think we're gonna call it there for the night. I hope you guys enjoyed watching, and we will see you next time. <laughs>